Hey guys, welcome back. Trip and Farm 4 Pop. I'm your host, Trip Coach, dropping knowledge bombs on all Forex Shark related projects. And in today's video, it is finally here. Our project is live, live and in living color. Shouts out to In Living Color, throwback 1990s. Anyway, <laughs> you can head on over to Sidekick Finance and find our uh, app. I'm going to actually show you how to get there in case the link is in the description, but just in case you want to come straight to sidekick finance, you can go straight to their homepage, head over to jumpstart, and then you'll find the campaigns here and then scroll down until you see our platform change 360 minting is live. So sidekick.finance and you can take those steps or look at the link in the description. So as i mentioned multiple times we have three tiers and if you want to mint one of these all you gotta do is come over here and say approve minting for whichever tier you want um tier one it's at the bottom for some odd reason i don't know why it's showing up that way but 100 busd for tier one 200 uh, nfts available in that tier Tier two is 500 BUSD, 100 available in that tier. And tier three, the game changer is only 50 available and $2,500 for that tier. So you would just select the one you want and hit approve minting. Remember, this is all done via smart contracts. Everything is coded on the back end, and then you will be signing the contract and proceed. And remember, if you're using Rabby, you can actually change the unlimited spend option to only exactly what you want to spend for the contract. So whatever that happens to be, you can hit confirm and then you would approve that spending. I don't have that. I'm not buying my own NFT, but that's how that would work. Very simple process. Now, remember in this, if we sell out 50% of the NFTs, that's where the task human access comes in. And if we sell out 100%, then there's more access basically. But even if we don't, and we only meet our goal of the $12,500, then you will still get all of these perks. So we will still honor specific privileges for the NFTs in the future. And some alpha, if you're watching this video, they will definitely be used in the task human integration in the six to 12 months. And you will probably get it for free if you keep that NFT. So that's something we will be giving to those people, even if we don't meet that crowdfunding goal of 50% to 100%. So just trying to, again, give real world utility to people that are supporting the project. Remember, I'm against the Ponzi nomics. I believe that we have to build true utility and I believe that you need to get that right out the gate, not speculative plays on what you think the potential will be and things of that nature. Remember, so there's no token involved with this. Additionally, uh, the perks that are included each tier gets a percentage of the crowdfunding wallet. So you are literally buying a portion of the revenue from this kind of participating as a um, supporter, crowdfunder or whatever. Can't say you're a venture capitalist or whatever that would be against the SEC, <laughs> but we're not selling securities. We're just selling an actual product. So anyway, you will also, if you keep the NFT, get bonus token allocation that will go towards the governance. So there will be a token in the future, but it will not be uh, sold in the sense that you see most uh, Ponzi nomic uh, platforms do it. We will actually have the liquidity generated from the revenue on here, and then we will be using the points that are uh, integrated through participation with our platform and basically allocate certain amount of tokens based on those points so that's all to be determined and you'll have to figure out how that works by participating with it so if you want to be a part of this jump on over to psychic.finance and by all means mint the nft even if you don't want one then share it with other people who might be interested in the exercise wellness holistic aspect of what we're doing and last remember i showed you guys uh updates here we have uh, some additional updates going on on the website. So shouts out to Lissandro, our front end UI guy, giving you guys some actual uh, progress on what's taking place in the app. So it'll look something like this, where you would come in and you'd have these toggles. I showed you this before on the back end. So just showing you what it looks like here on the front side. And you would submit uh oh, this information to get your specific health and wellness training plan. So what is your current fitness level? Novice, consistently worked out over a few months. From the options below, what best describes your current and singular health and fitness goal? Overall fitness, weight is not important. Focus on strength, flexibility, and mobility. Sounds like a great idea for our friend Jimmy here. Uh, how much purposeful exercise do you currently get per week? 
light one to three hours of moderate exercise and how much activity do you get outside of purposeful exercise very light sitting desk job the, the life of a youtuber right then you would hit get started so this is not the actual um ai i'm sorry uh front end app that's going to be integrated with the platform but this is the one that lisandro is working on so it doesn't go anywhere just yet but that's how you see how it will be linked up and then there's some more of the data that we've gotten in in place for representation of what we're doing on our app and then a simple walkthrough of how everything works what you can expect to see things of that nature so you can see this coming together as of right now we will only have one plan there's no subscriptions it'll just be this five dollar plan pay for that and you'll get this one day meal plan then there will be some upgrade options to get an additional bonus two days or turn this into a macro based all sorts of other things will come as we launch but this gives you an idea of what the website looks like as we are moving forward so you can see some development remember that's my big issue with what we currently have in the space there's no transparency so i want you guys to see we are indeed building things are indeed moving forward and I am indeed working on this as well as the team, not just smoke and mirrors telling you we're working on stuff and you don't get to see anything at all. And then behind the scenes, this is what the actual uh, back end looks like. I showed you guys this before on the channel. So we're gonna go back to Jimmy. He's gonna be 32, gonna be 177 centimeters tall. And he's gonna weigh 87 kgs. And his current fitness level now is going to be experience, comfortable with weights. And he wants to build muscle and he exercises moderately and he does continuous general gentle, moderate activity, like a restaurant server or something like that. So we'll find out what um, the AI represents for our friend Jimmy here. So once you submit that, you'll get this initial greeting. Greetings, Jimmy. My name is Chain360 and I'm a world-class nutrition, health, and dietitian expert. I'm here to help you reach your fitness goals and get the best results in the fastest, most sustainable way possible. Based on the provided data, your basal metabolic rate is 1,844 calories per day and your resting metabolic rate is 2,094 calories per day. Your BMR is the amount of energy your body needs to stay alive and perform its basic functions such as breathing, circulating blood, and digesting food. Your RMR is the amount of energy your body needs to perform basic functions when at rest. Given your current level of exercise and daily activities, you will burn approximately 2,941 calories per day. To reach your fitness goals of muscle gain, you will need to consume an estimated total of 3,941 calories per day spread out over the number of meals you prefer. In order to create a detailed meal plan, it would be helpful to know more about your dietary preferences and the number of meals you'd like to eat per day. Please provide further details so I can create the best nutrition program for you. I look forward to helping you reach your goals. Best change 360. So now we're going to provide this with Jimmy's dietary needs. So his current diet is unhealthy. No, no diet. I eat anything and no restrictions. Jimmy can eat anything because he does eat anything. And he wants about two to four meals per day. There will also be one more box here that will annotate uh, like a fill in the blank where you just type stuff. Basically, you can add things like, you know, high blood pressure or allergies and tolerances or something like that. Anything else that's not listed in these options. And this will also become a checkbox. So you can check multiple things here as well. But for now, at least just gives you guys an idea of what we're working with. So we hit submit and we will get the plan from the AI for Jimmy. Here we go. We got Jimmy's full meal plan. So personalized meal plan for breakfast. Have two scrambled eggs, two slices of wheat toast, one banana, approximately 400 calories. Uh, that's the approximate cost based off of um, <laughs> historical U.S. prices. We know with inflation, this has gone up quite a bit. Uh, half a cup of yogurt and some granola, chicken and vegetable stir fry, a cup of carrots, grilled salmon, roasted potatoes. Then it gives a sample recipe down here of how to cook that and the grocery list if you were to buy that and the hypothetical cost. And let's just say you're eating out. Here is a recommended uh, fast food version. Obviously not the healthiest, but at least it gives you the macros and the carbs and fat. And you can try to make that line up with the meals that you have here. And just to note, this is literally what we have to do with AI. So you have to fine tune things. So right now it gives a decent amount of uh, information, but these calories don't add up exactly to what uh, would be needed. So this is where the feedback comes in so that we can continue fine tuning the model. So it's not a one and done kind of thing. That's why I want you guys to understand that we're not 
uh, or how this process actually works. And that's why we incentivize the users to give us feedback so that we can turn this into a much more uh, dialed in model. But still for what you're getting, it'll get you much closer than anything else. And the more you interact with it, the better your results will be. So this will uh, be available basically from day one. This is the minimal viable product. And then there will also be options to upgrade to a two day meal plan, as well as some more detailed macros. If you wanted to build your own um, meal plan, just off of the macros and calories you need it, and you want to know what foods are in what categories. So these are some of the things we want to roll out kind of in the beginning, but minimum this one right here, what you're seeing here is what you would get right out the gate. No Pontinomics, any EVM compatible token, five bucks, and then you will be able to come back and actually give feedback on this plan so that you can get more tailored information. So ideally you would interact with this and follow up with some questions such as here, it would say, what progress have you made in your nutrition meal plans is our last discussion. And you would tell it, you know, um, let's see, such as it's not working so well for me. I'm not building any muscle. What challenges have you faced and success? Have you had in your training since our last discussion? I can't seem to eat enough to eat enough calories. What changes have you noticed in your body since you began the program? Still the same. So obviously with this, you want to be as detailed as possible. Cause again, the more information you provide, the, again, the better we can fine tune the model. Do you feel any adjustments need to be made? Yes. I need more calories per meal and the meals need to be easier and quicker to make. So this is where you would, if you were high, if I was hired like me or a nutrition or a fitness coach, they would basically do this interaction with you. So we have this being done on the back end with the AI and the AI will run through this, compare your old plan and then give you a new recommendation. Then it would kick out the updated information and take that into consideration and try to create a new meal plan. And uh, right here, it's basically just summarizing the old plan. So this is currently not that updated information, but again, showing you guys the progress and what we're doing and how this will actually work. So that is the wrap up and update for what we're doing. So first and foremost, head on over to sidekick.finance and mint yourself an NFT if you are bullish on what we're building in the future of integration with the drip ecosystem. And if you would like to participate or utilize our services, when the change 360 app launches, stay tuned on this channel and we'll let you know as we get closer to a launch date. But basically for now, I think this, uh, campaign runs for, um, another 36 days. So April 25th, I believe is the last day for NFTs, but don't wait till the last day. Help us out and share with somebody else that might be interested. All right, hope that provides some value. If it did, smash that HBO special up, brother. Like, subscribe, comment down below, and until next time, lift daily and achieve your impossible. See ya. Want to pay your in real life bills with crypto? How about send crypto directly to anyone with a bank account? Spritz Finance is a decentralized solution to be your own bank and connect your crypto earnings to real world bills and payments. They do not take custody of your assets and allow support on multiple blockchains and Web3 wallets. Sign up below using my referral link and you will get $50 back when you make your first $50 bill payment with crypto. Additionally, I will be using referral bonuses to airdrop, donate, or burn based on community feedback. Sign up now.